Hello again folks, it's Barry with Barry's A-Track and Classic Car Radio Repair and tonight's demonstration is going to be a unit from a 71 Mustang, it's an AM FM A-Track and it comes from Ken in Odessa, Texas. So uh, we're going to run it through, uh, it is uh, 10 to 8 at night and uh, I'm not sure how, how, long, how much longer the AM stations will be on so we're going to run it through kind of a quick FM test. <laughs> And I got all the presets set to FM stations, so we'll just run down that real quick. Okay, we're going to switch to our output level meters for a moment here, so we can make sure that the uh, all four speakers are going. Uh, this unit has a fader, not a left-right balance control, so we're going to go front speakers. And of course, we, there we go. Front speakers only. Rear only. Front, rear. Okay, and then we can, now we'll go to uh, AM and make sure we can pick up uh, the two or three AM stations that are available in this area. This is America's. or even with type 2 diabetes. And we should get, pick up one around. Uh, it would have but not one. There we go. There's our, there's our strong AM station. In the White Mountain area through Flag, uh, Flagstaff and, and around down to Payton. Okay, and now we're going to uh, test the A-track. You heard the familiar uh, AM interference on the, uh, on the higher end of the band there. And now we're going to plug an A-track into this thing. Got some temptations. I'm going to switch tracks a bunch of times. Oh, and this is a standard stock repair. This is not a conversion. So that's why it's not sounding as bright and clear as a lot of radios that I test. song in here so it's either going to switch tracks or it's going to go into the next song on that track been a while since I used the temptation stage so I'm I don't really move. there we go okay okay let's try another tape just for fun got some Ann Murray song here so it's either going to switch tracks automatically or go on to the next song on that same track we'll just wait and see what happens probably gonna switch oh I guess not okay, we're between songs on this track so there we go Pull our tape out. Radio should come back. And maybe the audience and there's our radio back. Understand how these things happen. And as is usually you know, the case, the there's interference and goes, birdies and whistles and stuff on the AM band. So let's. Uh, only thing left to test is the dial lamp. So let's test that real quick. Make sure it comes on. I'm going to cover it with my hand a little bit. Make sure that dial light works. And you can see it flashing on and off as I connect and disconnect it. So that completes the uh, test of this. Uh, one thing I'll. Uh, mention on this one uh, this unit arrived with a bent volume control uh, and I was able to straighten it but uh, I, could, I was not able to get the wobble out of the control without um, as you can see the control has a little bit of a wobble there and it's best to leave that wobble in rather than try to bend it again because uh, this fits inside of another shaft and uh, we got pretty lucky that we can actually turn this volume control all the way up and down without dragging the tone 
uh, without dragging the tone control along with it. So I, I don't recommend trying to straighten this any more than it is because you're probably going to end up making it rub against that tone control. So we'll just have to live with that. Unfortunately, this control is not available as a new part. It uh, hasn't been for decades. So um, on that not so happy note I guess we'll go ahead and end this video and I'll get out of here and get on to the next job and I am as soon as I can find my face here Barry with Barry's 8-track and classic car radio repair um, if you have an 8-track unit either for home or for car use and need of service needless to say you can reach me at 928-533-9666 um, I also do FM conversions on classic car radios I can add Bluetooth USB reader aux input and probably a couple other cool things so my website is in the description below thank you very much for watching listening and we'll see you next time